Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, I just got a little tired of constantly uploading Assassin's Creed Origins videos, so I decided to mix it up a little bit. This is an Assassin's Creed Odyssey sneak peek preview, because after I do Origins, I will be covering Odyssey, and... Shut up, guy. Shut up, guy. Okay, I'm gonna get away from him so I can talk. But... I'm gonna give you guys a little preview of what to expect from Assassin's Creed Odyssey, kinda, or just some gameplay footage that won't reveal anything specific to the plot. But so basically, what I'm doing here, this is a Spartan military camp outside of the city of Megaris. Yes, I said that really white. Is probably pronounced like Megaris, like that, like a, like a Greek would say it. So what you do is you have to get the nation's power down to where they're vulnerable, as you can see in the, the right side of the screen. So right now they are vulnerable because I invaded their fort right here. I did invade it, it doesn't say that I did, but I did. I invaded the fort, I killed a bunch of guys. None that it showed, but it, it did it enough, and then I broke into the leader's house and I did all that and then I I went down here and I completed that location now it says that it's a Spartan territory but it was originally an Athenian territory that I converted into a Spartan territory because that's what you do this this entire game is taking place during the Peloponnesian War so it's between the Spartans and the Athenians. There's territories controlled by each faction that you can turn to gain power for either Sparta or Athens. And obviously I'm on the side of the Spartans because, I mean, King Leonidas was a badass and the movie The 300 was also badass. So I'm fighting for the Spartans. This is right here, this location that my cursor is hovering over is called a conquest battle. So that is ultimately what turns the tides of war in the favor of whichever faction you want. That's what converts a city from an Athenian territory to this Spartan territory. That's since I had to decrease... Uh, I, uh, I changed it to a Spartan territory then I had to decrease the, the nation's power again so I could unlock another conquest battle, but I'm going to be defending the Spartans this time. I'm going to be on their side still, and I'm going to help them defend their territory. So let's let's get into it. Ah, eagle bearer. I thought the gods might have forsaken Sparta, what with the Athenian vermin infesting our land. But seeing you here makes me think they've heard our prayers. What do you need? Those filthy Athenians have been pushing on our borders long enough. Join us on the battlefield, and send them to Hades where they belong. I'll join you. Good. We're glad to have your sword. You know, my sword and my spear, Mr. Spartan Commander. Because I do wield. Not both, but I do wield. captain right there. So I have all these abilities because I kept my level, I kept my abilities, and the only, the only thing that changes is the plot, the story, because I'm playing in a new feature where if you complete up to a certain point of the game, it lets you restart your story progress, but keep everything else, like your gear and your level and your, your items, most of your items. Mm. 
You know, I'll just talk after the battle. I'm gonna, I'm gonna focus on this. I'm gonna show you all my abilities, though. This is one of them. Very effective. And then there's this. And then there's this one. Which is a very good ability. And I have... I didn't mean to click that, but it'll do. It slows time by quite a bit. Ooh, that was cool. I did like a block parry kind of thing against two enemies at once. And I killed both of them. This is, uh, this is an ability, it's called like God Rage or something. I think it just makes your attacks stronger and I want to say it makes you invincible to their attacks but I don't think it does that yet it's probably a later upgrade of the ability and then there's that it's great for enemy swarms but they don't usually swarm me that much. Honestly, that, that part, I don't think it's an ability. It, time just slows every time you do like a really good dodge. I'm not doing anything with the controls. I'm just doing a really good dodge. That was a horrible dodge. Oh, I don't really know how I did that, but that was cool. Neat, I never really tried that with the spear. Hold on, where's the captain? Let's go take him down. Battle's over. And we got 48,000 experience. Which honestly isn't that much because I retained my level of level 48. And there we go. Alright, so earlier I was saying that I retained my level and I was playing I'm playing in a new feature of the game it's a it's a new mode really where if you complete a certain point into the game it lets you restart the story while keeping your progress so that's why I'm a level 48 this is one of the beginning islands that you travel to so that's why I'm a level 48 and why I'm such a badass also cuz during that time that I completed that portion of the game, I also acquired the Demigod set of armor. That and the Spartan War Hero set of armor. This is part of a set of armor. And I equipped it to the Demigod set because it doesn't actually come with a helmet, so I just use that for extra armor. 
Let's let's see what we have here. We have this. We have these. So the demigod set comes with the uh, demigod bracers, the demigod belt, demigod chest plate, and the demigod boots. It also comes with this really nice sword of Damocles. I just have this. It's really I think it's a a unique item. Like you can only get one of them, you can only find one of them in the world. It's for doing a quest, which I honestly I haven't completed yet. And then I like this. The trident. I don't know where I got it, or how I got it, or if I can get more, but I like it. And I discovered this mercenary. But I could take him. I could take her. She ain't nothing. So that's my Assassin's Creed Odyssey preview. This is this is more or less what you'll see when I do a, a playthrough of the game after I'm done with Origins. So follow me on social media to keep informed about my new content uploads and subscribe and click the notifications button to also be informed because I mean it won't be soon but it'll be as soon as I can. So this was my Assassin's Creed Odyssey sneak peek for kind of what to expect in the, the next game that I play. So I will see you guys later. Take care.